every pilot, every person has negative self-talk in their mind. It's the voices of self-doubt. And they tell you things like, you can't do it. You're not good enough. You're not prepared. You weren't meant to be successful. But that's just not true. The way I stop the negative self-talk in my mind is first by recognizing it and then just saying, cancel, cancel. And I've stopped it at that point and then I can reframe it and change the words. Don Miguel Ruiz says that if you're going to tell yourself a story, you might as well make it a good one. Flying through life is when your passion and your purpose are in alignment and you're flowing with the current of life. It's about getting into alignment, not about spending your energy trying to figure things out, but identifying where you're being guided and going to that place. There's this common misconception that people have to suffer in order to get ahead, and I don't believe that's true. It's kind of like a swimmer trying to swim up a stream. And you can be a great swimmer, you could be the best swimmer, but eventually you're going to tire. If you are in alignment with your purpose and your passion, then you are moving with the current of life. When that happens, amazing things happen. The impossible becomes possible. Your dreams become reality. When you get into alignment, you will make more money. I was experiencing so many blessings in my personal life and my business life, and those were all things that I wanted to share. There are 19 concepts in the book that detail how you apply the spiritual concepts in your life and in your business. Those are the things that if done properly, you'll flow with the current of life and things become easier. Applied spirituality is applying the spiritual concepts that you learn in your life and your business. And that's the greatest challenge because it's easy to read about a concept in a book. The greatest challenge is applying it in your life at the exact moment when you need it the most. The reason why I needed to fly around the world in 95 days was to show people what's possible by using these, these concepts and insights. I wanted to be the example. I didn't want to be the person just talking about it. I wanted to show the world what was possible. So if you're moving with the current of life, then things become easy. That's what this book is all about, and I can show you how to do that. My three favorites are listening, reframing, and overcoming fear. The first thing you can do to move past some of your fears is to identify them. By giving them a voice, then you can take the message that's being delivered to you and then come up with a plan to get past them. As a pilot, my greatest fear was having to ditch my aircraft, the Spirit of San Diego, in the open ocean hundreds of miles from civilization. So what I did is I took an open ocean survival class. I bought the materials and supplies that I would need to survive in that situation. And I practiced getting out of the plane as fast as I could. By taking these small steps, eventually you can mitigate your fear. People want more in their life, more happiness, more joy, more peace, more connection. This book offers that. Flying through life helps make your journey easier. The impossible becomes possible. It is my passion.